Good morning, Don Lane. Fraser Valley News, your Monday morning news update for this Monday, January the 7th, the first full week of 2019 as businesses slowly get back together. CAD Rep, Chilliwack uh, and District Real Estate Board are about to uh, announce their real estate numbers for December, and uh, it has been a bit of a sluggish last couple of months, especially in Vancouver, and to a certain extent the Fraser Valley. All the details will be up on the website, FraserValleyNewsNetwork.com. Just Google FVN Fraser Valley News. BC Court of Appeal ruling on solitary confinement and uh, what prolonged confinement can do to someone who is incarcerated. And in the Valley, of course, we have a number of federal and provincial institutions as well as municipal jails in Abbotsford and Chilliwack. But most importantly, this is for the major institutions. So this is Mission, Pacific, uh, as well as Kent. And uh, that ruling is uh, supposed to come down uh, at least around 10 o'clock this morning from the B.C. Court of Appeal. We will be keeping an eye on that story. Langley will be hosting Rogers Hometown Hockey this coming weekend, January 12th and 13th. There will be road closures. But all the information for hockey fans will be up on the website. And yes... Uh, Ron McLean of CBC and Sportsnet will be there. Vancouver Motorcycle Show coming up in two weeks' time on the 18th to the 20th at Tradex. And as always, every year we do have tickets to give away to the Motorcycle Show. Have yourself a great day. If you are a small business trying to find an affordable way to advertise and promote, let us know. We may have something for you, whether it is a online ad, a banner ad, a sidebar ad, or perhaps a 30-second live read ad on this newscast every morning, which goes up on the website on our YouTube channel, Fraser Valley News, uh, around before 9 o'clock every morning, 24-7. So give us a holler, fvn at shaw.ca, fvn at shaw.ca, or call us at 604-392-5834. 604-392-5834. Have yourself a great day. It's supposed to clear up, and the rain is supposed to hold off today. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.